kind of left with tears in my eyes and called Josh and said, we gotta make it happen somehow. Like I want my kids to be a part of this. I'm Josh Grotenborg. I'm Casey Scrotenborg. We have a kindergartner, Ike, a three-schooler, Hattie, and one more at home who's a future ZCS student. And this is our ZCS story. With Ike, he's in it now. He's a kindergartner. And so we get to experience a little bit more of even the Zealand Christian culture. It's just been so great for us as parents and for Ike. One story that I just loved that he came home from, it was a rainy day this fall. and. There was a rainbow outside and he thought it was so cool that they saw a rainbow at the same time they were learning about Noah's Ark. So that was a total God experience in our six-year-old's eyes. He came home one, one day and we were, we were eating dinner and, and he, they did a book of friends. And he said, Mom, Dad, do you know that Jesus is everybody's friend? And we both just kind of looked at him and just smiled at each other. Just like, that, that's, we're in the right place. We wanted them to be surrounded on a daily basis with the Christian influence and um, teachers and staff who reinforce the principles and values that we're trying to instill at home. And also, uh, we really were loving the size of the school body and the sense of community at Zealand Christian. I had come to several chapels, middle school chapels, and I just stood in the back and watched, and I was blown away at uh, the student body, how um, they supported each other and encouraged each other, and kind of left with tears in my eyes and called Josh and said, we gotta make it happen somehow. Like I want my kids to be a part of this. It just to really see it firsthand has such a big impact. It was always in our head that we wanted a Christian education and it's just, you know, now we're to that point of making that decision. And we had come to several of the open houses or um, future family open houses before our oldest was even to school age and we were blown away at one year how well we were treated and greeted by the staff and then the next year they recognized us and we had we weren't even a current family. Yeah. So that made us really feel like we belonged already without even having a student here. That was very helpful as the open houses. I, I feel like it's you could come here and kind of see how it all works and meet people, meet the teachers and staff and it was, it was those were very helpful for, for me. Let the staff lead you through a virtual tour so you can see firsthand um, inside the classrooms, inside the chapels, uh, walk through the library, the gym, just the Spanish, the Mandarin immersion, all the opportunities that your kids will have. It's a big investment. It's a big investment, but you got to look past that too and look at what it really is about. Other things have to sacrifice, but is there a greater investment than our kids right now? And um, Sometimes that's a hard pill to swallow, but we would encourage families to it's, really look at it that way. It's worth it. I mean, you have an experience with your kids like we have. It, you don't even worry about that side of it, and you just know that it's the best place for your kids. And on a pretty daily basis, yeah. I would say we have affirmations from things our kids are saying, singing, um, experiencing that's like, okay, it is worth it. We made the right decision. It's worth the sacrifice and the investment that we've decided to make. Come to the open houses, meet the staff. Put yourself out there, attend the events.